Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today we're going to try a laxed siren beat. Um, I think this is also used in Savage Love. It's sampled. Um, and that song, I, I matched it up with the, uh, the original, so I really didn't match it up with Savage Love, but um, this is what they're doing in the song. Um, I don't know if they played all the way through. I didn't check that one out. So anyway, so you got... Okay, that's the whole song. Just keeps repeating. All right, so we need a C minor chord. We're going to bar the third fret, and then on the fourth string, we're going to grab the fifth fret. That's my C minor chord. Then once I got that, uh, I'm going to add my middle finger for the next chord. On this is an A flat chord. Uh, second string, fourth fret. That's all I need to do for the A flat. Then I need an E flat chord. First string, first fret. 3rd string and 2nd string at the 3rd fret. Okay, Then I need a B flat chord. Bar the 1st 2 strings at the 1st fret, 3rd string 2nd fret, 4th string 3rd fret. Those are my 4 chords that I need for the song. Okay, That's it. Now the B, uh, I'm just doing down strokes with my thumb, so that's all you need to do for that. It repeats this pattern of those chords over and over and over again. And um, the, the beat is kind of funky, so what happens is like on beat one, you're resting, and then you strum on beat two, then you're resting on beat three, and then you strum on beat four. And that's what you do, and you do it for two measures on each chord. So it's like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, next chord. So that's that's where it gets kind of funky, and uh, so we got C minor. You, you rest on beat one, and you play the chord, and then I stop the sound. So I go uh, one, stop the sound. So four times, and then A flat, E flat, stop the sound, and then a B flat. And that's it. I wish it was more, but there's not. Please subscribe. Uh, play more Oak.